Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. All right, yo, what's going on, everyone? Charlie checking in, coming at you all from our new <laughs> YouTube channel. Hey, like I say, it was just, it was uh, inevitable. It was bound to happen, so whatever, you know. So I'm happy I got all my uh, vlogs and stuff, the ones that we really enjoyed, um, backed up on... Um, USB and stuff so I can watch later on in life and uh, yeah, we're just gonna continue on um, Doing our thing guys as usual uh, Wanted to do a video this morning to kind of touch on the recent issues happening right now with Okay, I'm back with another one guys I'm gonna get right to it I've been gone for a while and I popped back one or two times this year and I haven't really looked to see what was going on. And y'all wasn't telling me for real. And when I do get any response, it's about his eating habits or, you know, that's great and all, I guess, to be concerned with his eating habits and to be wor worried about him eating too much and all that other stuff and it's, it's, it's good that y'all concerned, but you're concerned with the wrong things. After doing some recap for myself, I learned that you guys has failed that family. You failed the kids. And I'm mostly talking directly to you parents because there's a lot of parents out here, you know, the ones that are still together, the ones that are uh, that are divorced, separated, whatever reason you're not together. I'm talking mostly directly to you, I'm talking directly to the grandmas that's watching this and someone that's expecting a child for the first time. I'm talking directly to you guys. Yes, I'm singling you out like a sharpshooter. All right, right now you're in the you you're in the full frame of my bullseye, and if you don't like it, you know what you could do. Get the stepping. My point of saying this is better yet. I'm gonna let this man tell you himself. Check it out. So uh, uh, Jennifer would would get this guy Kyler. I'm pretty sure that this is how it happens. Jennifer would get this guy Kyler to uh, uh, come out and say that he's the one. That choked Johnny. Okay, he said that he was the one that choked Johnny, but there was nothing to it. That that uh, they were just wrestling over a belt. Okay, so Kyler would be the one that was high that Johnny was saying, and in, in reality, John, uh, Kyler is the one that uh, that that got high, overly aggressive, choked Johnny just a little too hard, but it was no big deal. He was high. This is coming from Johnny, and this is coming from uh, 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 Isaac. This is coming straight from Isaac's damn Twitter, showing the damn uh, text messages between him and him and Johnny, explaining what happened. And then damn Isaac, uh, and then Johnny tells him that that uh, uh, he was just a little high, not him, but Jennifer's friend. And then turns around and says that it was damn uh, uh, Kyler, not not David. So which one of them are your friends, Jennifer? Are both of them your friends? Was Richard and Dennis your friend at the same time? Huh? Having a little menage a trois over there? We know Jennifer don't mind dating a married man. Dennis, uh, Dennis, her friend, David, met Jennifer while, uh, while he was working with the married man that was sleeping with Jennifer. Kind of shit is that? Jennifer's gonna get some shit going on. She's out there sleeping with fucking married married uh, men. She's gonna have some crazy ass damn uh, wife come over there and kick her ass one day. You think most of this is all of this is happening last year? Ain't even up to current times. You think in the middle of a pandemic? which was in full force last year while this was going on. You think this will slow people down? 
make people more thankful, make people more grateful, make people more family oriented. You think that it will make people, you know, soften, you know, be better. But no. And why I say that? And why I say no? Take another listen. This is what weed and PCP does to you people. This was posted on Facebook a year ago. A year ago, this was posted on Facebook. Johnny would end up ODing, coding twice. And look at them just laughing at him. Watch him hold his head. He's like, man, I messed up. And then everybody on my mom's side of the family would see that on Facebook and be like, what the hell's going on? What's Johnny on? Come to find out it was weed and PCP, just like Jacob's on. Somebody's going around messing with that weed and getting it to the kids, watching these kids get all messed up and having a ball. Kyler, 23 years old, is coming around my fucking nephews. Jacob's 14. Johnny's 15. Jennifer knows that the last time that daddy got it from Kyler. And Kyler's back at the house. All right, let me get right to the point. Let me get all the way in like a spinal cord and plug into your brain. Let me tell you something. Y'all, you guys, and like I said, you parents, your grandma, your single parents, you soon to be parents. But definitely the ones that have been parents for a while. Oh, and, and, and most of all, you 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 AGB fans, you you know your angry grandpa fans. If I messed up on the letters, who care? And if you care about that that much, so you gotta leave some comments trying to correct me if I messed up on the letters. Then I'm talking to you too. So just add yourself to the list. If you care so much about them and y'all love them, I'm talking directly to the angry grandpa fans and you kid behind the camera fans and you little pick a boy fans, AKA sauerkraut. Y'all act like you so much of a fans of his and, and I can't believe you this and that. If y'all care so much, why haven't y'all called CPS? Well, what are you going to do is one, if enough of you call, it's millions of you guys that his fan. Millions, millions. And I'm talking two or three. If y'all sub to the channel, you're a fan. He got more. We got way beyond two million subs. And he ain't just got that. You know? And Angry Grandpa channel is mostly him too. Everybody say, oh, they're there for Grandpa. No, you're there for him too. All right? And the only reason you stay there is because of him. So let's let's just cut to it. You guys failed. And currently still is failing. Why would you see this? Why well, I didn't see this, you had to. I didn't even it did it, I didn't even look for this. I didn't even know this exists. I just started Going on, I just flipped on my channel and this stuff was scattered. Scattered like danger on a couch after Michael been sitting on it. On the front of my page, it was scattered. Like a, like a, like a, like the, like the, that the tartar from an egg McMuffin on his lips. I've eaten seven, eight of them. Um, 
the whole point of that is you guys need to, you guys should have called CPS along with angry grandma, their parents, their mother. You should have called along with them. They would have did something. You know, if at least 20,000 of you guys call, they're going to do so. Because that's a lot of people. That's a lot of people. I don't know what you guys is on, but you should have did that. You you should have been you should have been you should have been tearing up their comments. But why are you calling on and you and you should have called on Michael too. Now why I say that is if you've been watching and you're such a super fan. You will know when when Grandpa died and, and 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 the midst of him getting sick, he revealed in multiple videos during that time that he has legal custody, and he allowed his grandfather to, his father to keep him. Now you probably said, "No, no, no, you learn." I'm not even gonna go through all of that. The one somebody know that, and someone need to be in the comments confirming that. Cause Jennifer lost custody a long time ago, before we even, before he was even this big of a, of a YouTuber. So I'm not even gonna get into all of that, but y'all know what's going on. Y'all should have called up. Y'all, if y'all had did, them kids would have had a better chance. Them kids is toe up. All right, you got you. They all minors mostly, and they are, and they're taking drugs that are too hard for adults. Too hard for adults. You got this boy OD on on OD in the line. I heard that scattered upon the internet uh, months. I mean, almost last year. But I ain't really, I ain't really taking in because a lot of people are always capping and. And the spreading rumors and, and, you know, I just didn't get into it. But now it's true. Now, y'all can believe what you want to believe. I mean, you can look clear in that dude's face, Charlie Chill, and see that it's a lot of truth in what he's saying. Well, I, I just can't believe y'all run around claiming you fans of his. And y'all not doing anything about it. But OB, we did no. Just like some of y'all, and I am going back to your parents again. You quick to drive your kids six, seven states. Some of you people coming all the way from Delaware. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I'm talking to some of you. Some of you coming all the way from Delaware and New Jersey and, 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 and Massachusetts. Driving 20 hours, 20 some hours. When you're coming from Massachusetts all the way down to South Carolina, that's like 20 hours. I don't give a, I don't give a, how fast you're driving. Unless you, unless you're in a twin turbo Corvette or a Lamborghini and not just ever, and not just any Lamborghini, a Lamborghini Mercilago, the one with the V12. And, 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 and you somehow you got some special privileges so you can drive at a hundred miles an hour and better. And you don't stop at all. Don't even stop for fuel. But anyway, I just like you parents can bring your kids this for pull up and say something negative, something not one up negative, but something positive. And something serious about these kids. If y'all so-called care about these kids, and you so-called fans, if you pull up for a photo op, I start, and I still say this, and this is definitely my opinion, I don't care how you take it. I don't care how you take it. And I say again, I don't care how you take it. And if you bother with what I'm saying, you can dunk them. And you know what I mean by dunk them. Teabag, teabag. Set them on your tonsils. All right? I'm, I'm, I'm 
that I don't care. And y'all, if you're new to the channel, you're going to learn that I don't care. And if you're entertained by this video right now, be sure to check out the rest of my videos on the channel, which is equally and maybe possibly more entertaining. I'll let you be the judge. But back to schedule programming. Already in progress. I think you guys, if you pull up on him for unauthorized photo op and thinking you're going to hang out with him, you should be able to pull up on him and check him. You should be able to pull up on Jennifer number and check him. Well, no, everybody know what Angry Grandpa House is. Everybody. That house is more popular address than, than where Michael's is. And that's a popular address. Well, I don't really want to do that. You, If you pull up for a photo op, you should be able to pull up and say that. Every, every parent that's subbed to his channel, that's listening to this video of mine, I'm blaming you. I'm not going around. I'm, I'm blaming you for these kids being there and being abused this long and continuing to be abused to this current day and moment. At the time of recording this video. Hell, it's going to be even after the video that's going to continue. You need to call CPS. If enough of you report this, something will be done. And if enough of you report it, it will force them to expose the kids are doing well also. Instead of just hiding it so you can't report it. And if enough of you pull up for that reason, instead of to get your picture taken with a pretty much a pedophile, his a pedophile himself, date someone thirteen, why you why you're twenty five? Come on, we're not gonna get into that though, but <laughs> allegedly, canceled allegedly. <laughs> but um um on a real talk though real just keep it real let me be real though like i was being i was real not too the whole time but um that's how i feel that's how i feel if you're going to support them and you're going to that means you're supporting the abuse of these children. Well, anyway, be sure to share this video. Drop it in your Twitter feed. Drop it in your Facebook feed. Okay, you already did it. Drop it again. Support it. Give it a thumbs up. And most of all, subscribe now if you're new to this channel. And turn on your post notifications. And check out the rest of my videos if you haven't seen them. And also, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. The links should be in the description if they haven't appeared on the screen a few times already. I'm on to another one. Peace.